everybody, Michael Saylor with CARS. Uh, a little different shoot today. Uh, we've got a Macan, 2020 Macan. It's not an S, it's just a, a Macan. Um, yeah, I'm not gonna tell you where the car came from, really doesn't matter, but we're just gonna do a quick review on it. Um, the driving part of it, Stacy did the driving on this one, so it's a little different. Uh, anyhow, if you're new with the channel, uh, this channel is about military people talking about their vehicles. I'm retired Navy. It's not my vehicle, so it's a little different. We're just going to talk about the car anyhow. And I happen to have the paperwork that was in the glove box in the car. All right, so this is a 2020 Macan with a 2.0 liter turbocharged inline four. Pretty damn impressive if you ask me. It's got 248 horsepower and 273 foot-pounds of torque. Let me tell you what, this baby will slam your head back. Base price on this car is $50,900. Let's talk about the upgrades that somebody's going to pay for it sometime. Night blue metallic paint, $700. Standard interior, free. Deletion of model designation, that's free. If you do not want it to say something on the back, I guess like Macan, it's free to take that off. Panoramic roof rack. Oh, I'm sorry, panoramic roof system, $1,700. Driver memory package, $380. Porsche entry and drive, $800. Lane change assist, which we've come to hate, was an extra $700. Smoking package, we believe that means they put an ash tray and a cigarette lighter in the car. And by the way, that was free. Uh, Apple CarPlay, which um, on every other car I think is free. On this Porsche, it's $360. And of course, first year, 10,000 miles of maintenance, zero dollars. Oh yeah, for a grand total of $56,860. Now, it's a beautiful car. It's metallic blue. And while we're at it, let's take, we don't have to stop filming, let's just walk through it. Let's take a look at this fine inline four engine up here. Because I preset, look at that, man. That's pretty. This car has about uh, less than a thousand miles on it. And this engine compartment is just beautiful. Beautiful. It's clean. You can eat off this. We should cook on it tonight. What do you think? No? Okay. All right. Well, that's enough of the engine. Man, that's a solid sounding hood right there too. Let's check the interior out. Just follow me through. We'll just look at the interior. Why don't you pop over there? I'll open the door for you. We'll just keep this one rolling. Because this car... This car's got some impressive things going on with it. First off, you cannot open up the, the hatchback unless you're inside the car. We have yet to figure that one out. But we think it's got, uh, I don't know, these seats, these are standard seats. I don't know, they look pretty nice to me. They, uh, they, uh, they're pretty comfortable to sit in. It's got a nice little sport chronograph here in the center. A um, lot going on right here. Uh, I, I, this is like, uh, airplane pilot kind of thing going on here. A lot of buttons, temperatures, seat somethings, uh, sport mode, I did find that. I don't know what that thing does. Uh, some more things for your seat. Uh, up here, there's a picture of a car going down a hill. I don't know what that means. Big screen, let's fire up the screen. Let's see if we can get that on camera. Oh yeah, a little chime chime action. Look at that screen, can you see that, Stace? Boom, Apple Play, tied right into Stace's phone right there. Yeah, looks pretty nice, she, she liked that. But you get a lot going on here. Uh, and they put it in that mode, you're looking at the car, you put it in that mode, you're looking at Apple Play, devices, and yeah, a lot of stuff to look at there. So, uh, I don't know, hell, let's take it out and take it for a run. All right, well, it's a special Sailors with Cars. It's a first, and you know I like first. Why is it a first? Well, because my beautiful wife Stacy is driving. What's she driving? A Macan. Why? Why are you driving a Macan, Stace? So I can say I drove a Macan. There you go. Because we have one we to have drive one. right now. It's not our Macan. No, we did not buy a Macan. I don't just, think we'll ever buy a Macan. We're just driving a Macan. Oh, the person in front of me is driving a golf cart, so that's yeah. cool. Yeah, nice. Just checking it out. So what's your first thoughts of the Macan? It's big. I don't drive a car that's, that's this big, but it's okay. It's pretty smooth. Got to navigate around the golf cart. Um, and the car's going to yell at me for going out of the lines because it beeps a lot. Oh, wow. I actually went out of the lines and didn't get yelled at by the car. So that's why. good. I don't know. Maybe we turn that off. And of course, Pacer, you were never in the car. Yeah. 
yeah, the dog's not in the car, but I need my emotional support dog to ride with me, so. Um, so this will probably be the slowest Sarah's with car I don't ride so. you've ever gone on. We'll let you we'll let you get on a little bit when we get to the straightaway. Yeah, I well, did put it in sport mode for you. Oh, thanks. Thanks. Because you'll notice a difference immediately. Yeah, no, I think it drives nice. Yeah. I mean, like I said, it's bigger than my car, but... I have drove it for the last two days. Why two days? Oh, because it takes Porsche San Diego a while to change oil in your vehicles, apparently. But that's a whole other story. I've been driving this car since Thursday. Oh, a man driving his... Uh, tractor. His tractor down yeah. the street. Nice. Only in Blossom Valley. Um, anyhow, I drove it uh, all day Friday and some today. Which is Saturday. Uh, yeah, it handles. It's got, uh, it's got a little get up and go. Handles okay. So... Yeah. All right. It's nice. It's all right. Oh, there you go. Oh, no. Now it's yelling at me. I'm not really sure what I did. I think oh, I went in the bike lane a little bit, but... I don't know why it does that. It's quite annoying. Yeah. That would be the number one reason not to buy this car is because it makes weird noises all the time. And yells at you. Peter, what do you think? Peter likes it, but he likes every car. He's got his head in front of the AC. He's good. Of course he does. Can I have a little AC, buddy? Yeah, I mean, it's it's not bad. Oh, oh. oh God. I don't know what that's about. Because I'm, like, getting too close to the bike lane. Yeah, I mean, it's got, it's got more get up and go than my car. I know it's got a lot less get up and go than your cars, but um, that's a whole other story. Yeah, it's fine. You're probably not noticing, but if you look in the middle, it actually shifts down and holds the gear when you're in sport mode. So like you're in fourth right now. I don't even really know what that means. Well, it's just going to shift through the gears, and if you're accelerating in a lower gear, it'll hold that gear for a few minutes until it gets up and through it. Got it. Yeah, I like the I like the display on it. It's got a lot of the display is nice. Then again, I'm driving a 2011 Lexus Hybrid, which has no, pretty much nothing on it. No display. No. You can't even really read what you're listening to on the radio in my car. But that's okay. Peter likes it, so... I can ride in any car. Anytime I can be in a video, not I'm all about it. <laughs> all right, so when you take the left here, you know, if it's clear, give it a little hoopty poopty. Will do, will do. Peter, is it clear? Uh, all right. Clear on the right. There you go. See, I think it's got get up and go. That's all right. Well, I'm like flooring it, but yeah, it's got some get up and go. It'll go for you. You heard that from Stacy on it, floored. I don't often floor a car. With a get up and go. Because I drive pretty safely, but no. I Trust me, like that was pretty wild for, uh, <laughs> for my wife. Oh, oh, Jesus. Oh, even the car's complaining. Uh-oh. Are you going to have to edit that out, my swearing? No. Uh, okay, good. We don't edit anything out. It's the beauty of the channel. Raw footage carried over. <clears throat> when you crest the hill here, give her a little poop. Okay. And you're clear. Go. There you go. Look at you. Ooh, up to 90 speedy, miles speedy. an hour. Oh, It'll get up to 90 pretty quick, actually. Uh -oh. How's the braking? The braking is nice. I, I like this car actually. Oh. I mean, I don't. I would not buy one. Um, and if you can get me a Tesla Y to test drive, that would be awesome. But I don't think they're out yet. Yes, Tesla Y, because we're in the know on those, aren't we, buddy? We get emails from Elon himself saying, "Hey, sailors with cars, I've got a Y for you to test." <laughs> Woo Pre production. Woo! Are those in production yet? No, I don't know. Hey, sir, do you know? Well, Stacy, thanks for driving the Macan with us Not today. Not a problem. It was very nice of you to do that. Not a problem. Anything for you, my husband. Okay. As you know, I didn't want to be on camera, but I, I guess I figured that was just going to come to an end someday, so might as well make it now. All right, we're going to take her in the shop and, uh, whoa. Oh, we're getting up the hill. And, uh, getting crazy. And do the final on her. Checking out the handling. 
catch you back at the shop. All right, so we're back in the garage after taking this fine SUV for a little run down the road. Stacy drove, and let me tell you what, my neck hurts. That's right, she got all over this thing. Just kidding, she did get on it though. She said she liked it. Anyhow, hit us up on, uh, what, what am I gonna say here? Hit us up on Instagram, hit us up on uh, Facebook, and of course, uh, YouTube, Sailors With Cars, sailorswithcars.com. Uh, another great interview. You get me? I think that's always awesome. So anyhow, YouTube, we'll catch you next time. Thanks for watching.